With so many deadly terror attacks, therapists say it can trigger PTSD and high anxiety among even the youngest of ages. The Now's Ray Daniel shares with us how children can also deal with trauma. An evening turned deadly. 22 people killed, several injured, including children. Be at like a concert with kids and all that stuff is just kind of scary because I'm sure parents were just like super worried about their kids and all that stuff. At the Creighton Children's Center, therapists work with children who have experienced trauma. And when incidents like Manchester happen, psychologists say children can be reminded of their own traumatic experience. Whenever they um, see something on the news or the media um, that's traumatic, especially when if they hear that children were killed, so that's more relatable to them. It can re-trigger maybe some events that have happened to them in the past, even if it wasn't. I mean, most of them won't have experienced a mass shooting or explosion before. Um, but anything that's happened to them that they relate to in any way, um, it can re-trigger them and they might have symptoms again. That can lead to an increase in anxiety and a change in behavior. You would see disruptions in things like eating, sleeping, um, even like bathroom habits, that kind of thing um, would be disrupted. So kind of any kind of change from how they normally are. The best thing you can do when you witness this, talk with them and understand how to help them cope. You don't dismiss it as saying, oh, that happened really far away. That would never happen here. That you really listen to their concern and validate what they're worried about and what their experience is. Our adult minds, it makes sense that that was really far away. A child can't conceptualize how far away England is. Um, and so really validating their concern is going to be very important and will help decrease their anxiety in and of itself. For the Now KC, I'm Ray Daniel. Psychologists also recommend talking with your child about a plan to keep your family safe, whether that's at school, home or any public setting.